Hey everybody, welcome to Sid's Tips. And today I wanna talk about the gum soft picks, whether they're the original or the advanced. It's been a while since I've done a video on these. Uh, I still use both. In fact, I just got a, another pack, uh, 270 picks of the advanced. And uh, just what I really wanted to share with you today is people are commenting and asking me, well, how do you properly use them? how to avoid these breaking and bending and all that. So I was reading some other comments and just wanted to show you, now I know you probably don't like watching people you know, clean their teeth, but we're gonna do that today. Now I'm gonna put a link for both of these in the description so you could check them both out. Also be sure to subscribe to my channel, greatly appreciate new subscribers and click that bell icon so you can get updated uh, videos as soon as I post one. So. Uh, the, the real big difference between the two, obviously, is the handle. It's more bendable. Now, it does say on here, uh, it's curved, design, easier reach between teeth. Uh, it does come with cases. Uh, and so it really becomes a, a preference for both. Now, keep in mind, throughout your mouth, you'll notice that some of the gaps between some of your teeth are going to be wider than others. So if you find that you have a tighter part of your mouth between the gap, don't force it, because that is what's going to break it. If you have an easier and wider gap, then you can force it right through. Like, I could do my, my front teeth right here. I can go back and forth real quickly, where if I find a tough spot right here, you know, I don't want to probably force it through. Right here, it's really tight there. Don't force it through. And then you can go through your mouth. The same thing with the, uh, the advanced. And you can just go through your mouth, with both, <laughs> I can use them both at the same time. And you'll see, they'll, they'll hold up. Um, I do, I, I like the, the tips, it's almost like a brush, it's brushing through. You will find sometimes when it's nice, when you can depend on them, but you will find sometimes you got something stuck in that tough tooth, and you might have to use multiple ones of these. But again, if you wanna make them last and not get frustrated with them, again, when you are using these, any part of your mouth, Find the teeth and where the gap is tighter, just don't force it, and you'll find that you'll like these more. Uh, I like them, they work well. Uh, I've tried you know, other types of you know, dental floss where you know, if you're going up and down, it's sometimes uh, with my teeth, it starts fraying the string. Uh, with this, you know, you're going in and out, in and out, and eventually you'll find that it works well, and just listen to your mouth. So there you go, that's my story. I'm sticking to it. Let me know which one you like. Do you like the original? Do you like the advanced? Which one? And um, any comments you have, please leave those below. Really appreciate your time, and I hope this video is of help. All right, everybody, have a great day. Thanks for watching, and happy flossing.